Hello YouTube, it's me, Amanda, and today I bring you what is the last box of my subscription for Zenpop Stationery. It is for, as you can see, for May 2022. Um, this will be my last box for just, for now. If I ever get the opportunity because the reasons to um, subscribe again, I definitely would would in a heartbeat. You know, it's been fun and it's been not disappointing. So let's just start on out. So of course you get your postcard with Luna. She's on one of the koi kites you see in Japan, the wind socks. And as always, if you can figure it out, this is the website you go to to scan the barcode to see what you have. And it comes with a $5 off your pack, you know, for your next subscription, should you order. And let's dive right in. Okay. So the first thing I notice is that we have what looks like to be stickers cause you, that you can write on and they and uh, you could see on the back they're each individual but they're all rolled up so I think you just peel each one off as you need them oh and I should uh, say that the theme according to my research for this box is like every day in Japan so we're gonna take that out next Next, we have these adorable pencils that look just like Strawberry Pocky. These are so cute. I almost don't want to even use them. I want to keep, kind of keep them nice. They're a little thinner than what you would expect from like normal pencils. And they are a Type 2B. Next, we got sticky notes that look like one of those like road signs. Yeah, as you can see, it says right here, construction site sticky notes. And this is from the Japan division of Hallmark. And you can see on the back, it gives you instructions on how to prop it up. So you could just like put it on your desk and take one as needed. Next, we got this like little flip book. It, these look like checks. But I think, but I think they're pretty sure that these are just like memo notes. What are these? Oh, so this is. Oh, I know what this is. This is the highlighter that's supposed to look like they're condiments. You could either get this one or you got the wasabi one. I'm going to just open this up real quick. Yeah, that's what it is. This is it. Oh, shoot. This has plastics. But I'm actually excited to use the color because purples are my favorite color. And this is like a nice aubergine. that to the side next we've got flake stickers and these ones are based off of all oh, different foods and different desserts you can get in Japan little candies and all so like if you ever want to do like a spread that's based off of uh, food like if you're going out with your friends to eat this would be like a really nice one Next, we got Sweets Mini Cards. They're, they're just like mini, you just write a little mini notes on, on the two desserts. And then the envelope is like their wrapper, so it's like you're opening up a dessert. That's cute. And 
and I believe I know I should be should have been using the cards, but I was having so much trouble with the the um QR codes, so you know, I had to do my research in advance. This is just like a little keepsake box. It's pre you know, it's uh pre-lined, so it's easy to fold and this is just the instructions they give you to assemble it so you can keep things in here. And then last but not least, what is this? It is the Evolution Eraser. Oh, okay. This is cool. This is based on, like, if you're, like, a natural history or a paleontology buff like I am, you're going to appreciate this. Because it's an eraser, but on the one side, it depicts of us as, like, you know, Australopithecus, you know, when we were still very ape-like, but we were starting to, you know, walk on our hind legs, and then as you turn it over, it transformed to what modern-day man is now. I really like that idea. That's, like, really creative. And our final check for anything else until further notice. All right, as the box says, thank you for watching all my unboxing videos. I hope you enjoyed this, and if you like this channel and these videos, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye.